This is probably the most difficult project I've had to work on to sort of come up with the concept for. Maybe because of how extraordinarily particular and special the Casa Luis Barragan is. My name is Elena Filipovic and I'm the curator of Emissaries for Things Abandoned by Gods. This house is extraordinary for the way that Baragan thought of light and space. I would say objects have a really special role for Baragan in how he directed light and space. I was very inspired as well by the fact that if you're not Catholic, um, I happen to be, but if you're not and you encounter some of these religious and devotional objects that Baragan collected and had in his house, you must realize how extraordinarily gruesome some of them are. All of it sort of inspired me to think about who are the artists today who are not afraid to work with a contemporary imagery that is also potentially uncanny or violent um, or also just um, gruesome in its, in its imagery. For me, contemporary artists help us understand the world uh, that we live in. And so it was important to bring together a group of really extraordinary artists making work that might help us understand the world better today. This was, in a way, the response to Baragan's own choices. If Paragon were living today, not only what might he collect and what might appear in his house, but also what might be potentially a bit critical of his own position. As Baragan was someone who himself collaborated with, uh, with a number of artists in the thinking about the interior of the house, so too the artists that are included in this project are, in many cases, artists that I've worked with before, for which I could have a dialogue about what it would mean to kind of imagine this house with every single object that Baragan had included in it, taken out and replaced by a contemporary emissary. Correspondences between an artwork and its emissary or an object and its proxy 
um, are in each case different. They're either formal connections or conceptual connections, or in some cases I really wanted uh, a critique or a response to Baragan's original. is collaborative in the same way that the Casa Luis Barragan's interior was collaborative. There are certain works in this uh, house that are almost so sacred and so connected to the house that for some people, removing them will already be a blasphemous, sacrilegious act. But as soon as you get beyond that and you sort of enter this experiment, and it really is one in time travel, I hope that the public will realize that each and every replacement each and every proxy for um, an ancient thing that is replaced by something new or newly made is a sensitive one, is a considered one, is one that tries to respect the house, but also tries maybe to push our understanding of Aragon, of his time, of his belief systems, and also just to push it so that we might understand it better. It was important that the show or this project not appear like a provocation, but rather like a very sensitive understanding of what each of the original artworks that were here meant for Baragon and how we might think about that meaning today in the present. Thank mm -hmm. you.